Yeah, so I moved, um, I actually moved to Virginia a few years back and, and I was living in the Blacksburg area. And, um, you know, you have the New River and Claytor Lake. Uh, you see massive bodies of water just everywhere. And, uh, uh, so when I moved uh, to the Shenandoah Valley, like all of a sudden I'm like, I don't have this massive lake that's like 10 minutes, 15 minutes from my house anymore. So I just started like driving around and I, I would Google Earth and, and look down on the map like, oh, I bet you you could probably paddle that, maybe. And so I would just drive. And so I just started finding all these stretches of river and the South River was one of the first ones I sort of kind of explored. And it's so close, like, you know, there's a lot of people who live in Stanton, Waynesboro, even like Crozet, and, and you know, even as far as like Pittsburgh. But, um, you know, if you work in this area and you, you make kayak or canoe or something and some other river is raging and you're like, oh, I want to go paddle that, but you don't have time because you have like responsibilities as an adult and you have to work or you're in school. You know, the South River is just like kind of this sleepy hidden gym sitting here and it may not be the most extreme thing, but you know, it's very accessible and convenient and you can get on in the river uh, pretty easily and quickly and, and, and have like, an afternoon paddle. When Angel first invited me out to go paddling with him, I was like, oh yeah, paddling on the river should be easy. I've done stand-up paddle boarding before. And then we got out on the river, and within the first few minutes, I was like, this is completely different from any paddle boarding I have done before. Paddle boarding in the intercoastal waterway was just so much different than a river with some rapids and granted the rapids were no more than let's say a class one but it was a lot of fun and it's something that i definitely like to do again oh my god that's exhausting <laughs> oh my god.